Greece may exit the single currency. It could lead to a Greek exit. A Greek exit. A possible Greek exit. For Greek were to, to exit and, and for that exit, Greek exit, exit from the euro. Euro. Of the rest of So something of a Greek chorus is built up about a Greek exit from the euro. In fact, they've even minted a word for it. The Grexit. But if Greece really does decide to leave the euro, how will it do it? It's a pretty harsh economic climate out there. To understand this, let's think of a more familiar kind of Greek exit. Let's do it with the help of one of the Mediterranean's finest exports, the kebab. Think of it this way. Imagine this kebab is the Greek national economy. People are constantly shaving off what they need from it to buy food, set up mortgages, or broker international loans. It must never stop turning or it will be spoilt. So how do you switch currency without losing momentum? Once it is decided that Greece is leaving the euro, the first step would be to close the banks. Then they'd need to crank out a new currency. We'd probably see the return of the drachma. Though ultimately, it could take months to print the number of drachma required for Greece's economy. Before the banks reopen for business, domestic bank accounts, wages and prices would have to be changed into the new currency. Let's go back to the kebab to understand what other safeguards would have to be put in place during this delicate period. Imagine the rice inside this kebab is the euro. I need to swap it for this other rice, the drachma. It's a delicate operation, so I'm going to deploy these dolmades. They represent capital controls, which ban people from moving their money. The dolmades wrap up the rice so that no one can take it out the country while I'm switching currency. The rice is swapped and placed back inside the pit of bread covering, ready for consumption to resume. The dolmades can now be safely removed. Now, when a new currency is ready, it would probably be introduced as equal to the euro. But then it would be allowed to trade freely and would almost certainly fall sharply against the euro. This would be a testing time when many Greeks would feel like they were being squeezed even further. But as it falls, Greece's products would seem cheaper compared to other countries, allowing the country to stabilize and restore its true standing in the world economy again. Then again, if Greece does become the first country to leave the euro, this might encourage other countries to follow the same path, meaning the whole euro currency project could be skewered. So it might be that everyone ends up coming a cropper. Lus.